We view both of these teams taking the field tonight. The Longview Lobos and the Lufkin Panthers, a classic East Texas rivalry between two undefeated teams. It's the first time these teams will meet in district play since way back in 2003, but the bitterness of a rivalry has always remained. You know, Lufkin back in the district, you playing for, you know, district championship playoff spot, uh, seating uh, in the playoffs. I mean, there, there's a lot of things on the line with district play. and. You know, it makes it feel like a playoff game. The Longview Lobos are number one in the state for a reason. Nobody has been able to stop them so far. Jalen Hale, Taylor Tatum, Jordan Allen, Willie Nelson. I mean, that's just a few of the stars on their roster. And of course, head coach John King, earning his 200th career win last week. He's synonymous with the Rockin' L, and he knows all about the Lobos having a target on their backs. But he also knows what it takes to get the team focused and ready for a big matchup. That's our main focus, making sure that we take care of the Lobos, what we need to do during the week, and prepare for the upcoming opponent. Lufkin only won four games last year, but it's a brand new year, and they're already 3-0. They went on the road to take down A&M Consolidated last week, behind a vicious rushing attack and a balanced passing game. It was a statement win that have all eyes on the Panthers now. Head coach Terry Quick knows that, and he's prepared for a physical game against the Lobos as both teams try to stay unbeaten. Longview always has had the, the the style of line up, get foot to foot, and and run right at you, you know. And uh, they've had a lot of success doing that. Hard nosed kids, tough kids, a real physical football game. Longview, Lufkin, what do they have in common? Team names both start with an L, but they're both going to be trying to take home that W tonight. So we'll see who can get it done. Ashley, David, back over to you.